Hey guys, this is Paddy from GFB. This is part two of our G4 setup series. In this video, I'll show you how to tune the boost parameters. The first thing you want to do is select the preset you want to tune. There are six presets plus scramble, and we'll go through that in part three of the series. For this purpose of this, we'll just set up preset one. Now I'm going to start the car, and then we'll hit menu once, and that'll get us into the duty cycle menu. Duty cycle controls the boost pressure. It is adjustable from zero to 100. So basically a duty cycle of zero gives you the lowest boost pressure that your turbo and wastegate can produce, while 100 is the maximum. On the screen, you'll see that the current uh, duty cycle followed by the peak boost achieved. Right now, the peak boost is zero because we haven't done a run yet. We're gonna leave the unit in the duty cycle menu and go for a run. And what we're doing is recording the peak boost pressure. In this car, we'll be using third gear and sweeping through 3,500 RPM at full throttle. Uh, we'll be starting with a duty cycle of 10, as we know this is a, a low value and a good place to start. On that run, we achieved a peak boost of 3.9. But since our target is 17 psi, we're going to increase the duty cycle um, up until 40. I'm going to go straight there, um, but I would suggest only going 10 at a time. You'll notice that it's cleared the peak boost, and we'll have to perform another boost run to record a new peak boost. On that run of our duty of 40, we got a peak boost of 5.1. Uh, it's still well off our target, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna increase it up to about 60. Usually, again, you'd not increase it this much at a time, but we're pretty safe because we've already set our uh, overboost at 18.5, so that's a safety that won't let the turbo over overboost. Um, but yeah, usually you just do it incrementally. Now we're doing another run to record the peak boost at a duty cycle of 60. On that last run, we saw a peak boost of 8.1. What we're gonna do is we're gonna increase this straight up to 90. Again, usually you just creep up on this, but we've done a previous boost run and we know this is the setting we want. On that run, we achieved a peak boost of 17. Now to store this as our target boost, we'll hold down the menu button and that will save that as our target boost. And when you scroll through the presets, when you get back to preset one, it will show you what your target boost is, 17. And then it will show you what boost you're currently running in the normal running mode.